The perfect being, you said? Well, I have to tell you the honest truth as I see it. In this world, nothing perfect exists. It may be a cliché, after all, but it's the way things are. That's precisely why ordinary men pursue the concept of perfection. It's infatuation. But ultimately, I have to ask myself, what is the true meaning of being perfect? And the answer I came up with was nothing, not one thing. The truth of the matter is, I despise perfection. If something is truly perfect, that's it. The bottom line becomes, there is no room for imagination. No space for intelligence, or ability, or improvement. Do you understand? To men of science like us, perfection is a dead end, a condition of hopelessness. Always strive to be better than anything that came before you, but not perfect. Scientists agonize over the attempt to achieve perfection. That's the kind of creatures we are. We take joy in trying to exceed our grasp, in trying to reach for something that in the end, we have to admit, may in fact be unreachable. In other words, you may think that we operate on the same level, but you are wrong. The moment you started talking about perfection, you embraced an impossible concept and had already lost to me. That is, of course, if you are indeed a scientist at all. 